nearly a hundred years, the Incas, under the rule of many great leaders and with a powerful, well-organized army, forged a magnificent empire. Today, we marvel at their society. Art, science, buildings, engineering, and their devotion to the gods. A train and a bus take tourists to the imposing mountaintop citadel of Machu Picchu. It was unknown to the outside world, undiscovered by the Spaniards, until found by the explorer Hiram Bingham in 1911. What Bingham found, overgrown by jungle, was a remarkable archaeological site. There were over 200 residential buildings and a number of unique structures for spiritual or ritual functions. These structures included Intihuatana, the seasonal sundial, sacred rock, and the Temple of the Condor. The Temple of the Sun has a tapering tower which points through a window to the rising sun of the June solstice. Pizarro had just 180 men, one cannon and only 27 horses against an army of 80,000 led by Atahalpa. At the city of Kashmarka, north of Cuzco, Atahalpa was duped into having a peaceful meeting with the conquistadors. But Atahalpa and his unarmed retinue were tricked. Seven thousand Incan soldiers were massacred by Pizarro and his small force, with Atahalpa taken hostage. Spanish and Incan influence is evident in the architecture of Cusco. The Church of Santo Domingo rises from the foundations of the Inca's Sun Temple. In music and dance, Spanish and Incan cultures blend.